was coming up Yeah, always had to prove that I was tough enough to do better I always had a plan that I would level up And we don't know no better So I wrote these love letters to the city Yeah, yeah, to the city Yeah, feel, feel like I'm stuck in a trap I'd be playing in traffic Stuck in the middle of the map I had a rent and the taxes. I've been out looking for substance or something to make me feel love and accept. I'm so tired. I am running late for the train. I'm not the train. It's running late as well. Whew, tired. There's a train. This is my first solo trip. So I'm pretty excited. My sister helped me get on the train and stuff, but yeah. Whew, it's pitch black out here. And by myself, but it's okay. <sighs> Tiger. And it's so dark over here. Darkness out here. Hey guys. <sighs> I'm so tired. I probably should have brought my inhaler. I just realized that. Oh. At the tall light pole. <sighs> We're outside. There's the train over there behind me. You guys can see it. So yeah. Train's coming. Whoa. <laughs> that baby's fast. Okay, so I'm in my sleeper car right now. I may be able to see the lights outside. Um, but yeah. So this is the sleeper car at night. Oh, yeah, we are passing stuff outside. Okay, so this is the sleeper car at night. Um, pay no attention to my chunky feet. They're extremely swollen right now. Um, you got two spaces for your water. This is actually the table. Um, this actually is an air vent. Uh, let's see here. Um, that is part of the chair. So they let down the um, chairs and stuff so it turned into a, a nice size bed. Uh, let's see here. You have your own thermostat. Um, that is like to call the attendant. Um, let me see air conditioning air conditioning so it's highly ventilated in here which I like those are lights over there I have lights above me this is like the door right here um, you get to lock it there are curtains you can hang up your coat if you want to but I'm actually using mine it's behind me in order to like prop myself up and this is the curtain I do have a sink I'll show you guys later on um, a sink and there's a toilet which I have my stuff on top of then that is the bunk area up there which you can just like slide down here but obviously I'm just chilling by myself so I don't need that and then uh yeah um oh I like I said I have a sink and mirror and everything else so this is the locking system just in case you're a solo traveler and you want to know exactly how um velcro is not really sticking yeah but so yeah, that is all for right now. If you guys have any questions, let me know. Oh, and that's the trash can. Here's the menu if you guys want to see it. I already ordered the Asian barbecue glazed salmon, uh, the roasted salmon, Asian barbecue sauce, broccoli, lemongrass, scented rice, uh, shiitake, mushrooms, carrots, peppers, and scallions. And I also got a uh, sweet tea. Uh, so yeah, that is it. Screenshot that if you want to know. Um, breakfast is in the morning at 6. So I'll probably catch that. And uh, yeah, I get off at like, what, 10 in the morning? So I'm just going to probably chill and watch Netflix. Now 
was coming up. Yeah, always had to prove that Looks I was like we're taking off again. Do better. Always had a plan that I would level up. Now we don't know no better. Yeah, so like we're these love letters to the nice. city. Yeah, yeah, to the city. Yeah, yeah. feel feel like I'm stuck in the trap. Rather be playing the traffic. Stuck in the middle of the map. Higher the rent and the taxes. I've been out looking for substance or something to make me feel love and acceptance. Knowing I never had I've options. The city my home. only direction. I just want to run away. Got a dollar in my dream. Poverty really be bothering me. Been in the city keep calling to me. I'm infatuated with the street lights. New faces, new designs. I'm inspired. I never had someone on the inside. So I break the wall to get in right. Never had enough when I was coming. Always had to prove that I was tough enough to do better. Always had a plan that I would level up. Now we don't know no better, so I wrote these love letters to the city. Yeah, yeah, yeah to the city. No, I wanna run away to the city. I fell in love with the city. Knowing all I ever wanted was a chance, huh? It's someone to count on. The city as a landscape, it came straight out the ground, huh? Scared of that work, to take loss to win. Uh, I used too much of myself to start the way I began. I could feel that energy, just that frequency of the stars. They say, Who you know might change your life, but what you know is all yours, and I can't sleep. I guess I'm just addicted to that mindset of change your life, but life will change before you close your eyes next. Never had enough of I was coming. Up. Always had to prove that I was tough enough to do better. Always had a plan that I would level up. Now we don't know no better, so I wrote these love letters to the city. Yeah, yeah, to the city. No, I wanna run away to the city. I fell in love with the city. Right? Yeah, never had enough when I was coming up. Always had to prove that I was tough enough to do better. Always had a plan that I would level up. Now we don't know no better, so I wrote these love letters to the city. Good morning! I think we're actually in Ohio right now, so... Yeah. So it was snowing last night. Let me show you guys. See? So I think I'm about to get me breakfast. If it's still available, and um, I'll catch up with you guys on the way. Pretty sure I'm looking at a landfill. It's pretty bad, too. Girl, I know it ain't been easy. You've been split right, even.
my whole life trying to find something. I think I found it with you. Just in case I didn't show you guys before, this is what everything looks like let down. Okay, so I'm not sure if you guys heard that. My nose is peering horribly. I gotta take care of that. Excuse it. Sorry. My skin. Um, yeah, it's really dry because of the trip. It's cold. Anyway, so apparently time is about to go back in an hour. Well, 15 minutes. Sorry. It's 10.17 and then the time is going to go back. So in 15 minutes we change the time zone. Let me take care of this really quickly. Hold on. A little bit better? Maybe? Okay, so... Time goes back in 15 minutes. Well, it's whatever. So all I'm gonna do is have the um, personal assistant, I don't really know what to call him. He's pretty cool. Um, come in and let down my bed, cause they said like 90 minutes. So I'll give him enough time to let down my bed and we'll bring it back up to reclining status. And then uh, what else do I need to do? Yeah, my train ride is almost over soon. It'll be the last stop, and then to the hotel. Well, I want to go to the altar first, and then the hotel, because there's a couple of supplies I have to get, so yeah. Alright, so I hope that you guys can see, but I also don't want to mess up the video quality, so. Um, this is the table right here. Just it up. Pull it out. What's up here? Can't pull it out here, but I got really chunky thighs, so that really wouldn't help me. So, yeah. Um, that's cool. Uh, what else? Um, again, I did say that you can control uh, this to make sure that the air doesn't come out. You do have it on both sides. You can control the heat. I didn't touch it though. Uh, air vent, air vent, air vent, air vent, air vent. Um, speaker i believe one of those are the speaker when they're talking to you you have lights up there lights there you have soap on dispenser that's a cup towels they give you two things of soap here um you have speaker volume i'll turn mine's up a little bit just because last stop um lights here this is the reading light it's pretty bright then you have that one does get pretty dark in here if you turn off all the lights. See? It gets pretty dark in here, even with the one shade open. So, yeah, I am going to turn back on the wall light. Uh, turn back on. There we go. Cool. Um, What else you guys probably want to see inside the sink? Let me do that for you now. I think I actually showed you guys the same clip. Uh, does say sink is open, so there's the sink. I'm not sure if you guys want to see the toilet. I'll probably show you guys before I go. Sorry, doing this with one hand. There we go. That's done. Um, oh, there's a light in the mirror. Well, mirror light. There you go. Um, toilet flush. Toilet out of service. Sink down. Yeah. It's foaming. Cleanser. You have your outlets right here. Trash can. Toilet paper. Uh, instructions. Not really sure what I'm missing. Oh yeah, you also have this room light switch right here. Um, this is the lock, just in case you are a solo traveler. Um, can lock and unlock right here, so you just swivel this and then this comes up. You have your blinds. Um, up there is the bunk bed situation. 
Um, as far as I'm letting down your bed, I didn't realize this. So basically you can recline this, I'm not really sure how, but as far as them actually letting down your bed, I guess they're the only ones that can do it because they literally just take like the whole entire bed part away. And then like, they leave this here. Um, challenges as far as sleeping, when they take this part down, for the bed, this part is just kind of up. Like, the pillows are extremely, extremely soft, so... Um, you can fold them any way you want and just kind of, like, build up your support. But if you like, it cramps up your neck. If you like to be raised up a little bit, even, like, with me using this as a, um... What? To lift myself up? Uh, as leverage, it... That's fluffy, too, so it didn't really work well. So, um, yeah, that was something that I dealt with. Also, um, obviously the train shakes a lot and vibrates a lot. I'm a part, type of person, like, if my spine shakes a lot, I don't like that. Or, like, it starts to go numb, it just, it's not a good feeling. So I did have to, like, adjust myself, um, a couple of times throughout the night just to make sure that that wasn't happening so I wasn't in any type of pain. Uh, this is where the toilet is. Again, you lift up the seat. If you are, like, if it's like this and it shouldn't be too much of an issue for you to use a bathroom, if you have to use a bathroom when the bed is down, it is a tighter space. And it is not thick girl friendly, just to let you know. Here's one leg. So yeah, um, obviously I can fit there, but when you go to, you know, make sure that you're clean down there. It's a little, you gotta maneuver a little bit, so it's doable. So that is everything. If you guys have any questions, let me know. The next time I will probably see you guys is editing the train and then also on um, Union Station. So, see you there. Alright guys, looks like it's the final countdown. Um, we are in Chicago, you can't see, but we're in Chicago. So in like 15 minutes, I gotta get off the train. So, yeah. Got the airplane right there. And then here's the city. We are officially in Chicago, folks. And with that boat is all over there. Can't really see it. So I'll have my telephoto on. That's not insane, guys. It's been a while since I've been in a city with like skyscrapers. I think that's the right skyscrapers. I think all of this pretty much stuff. Coming from New York City and having not been there in like, what, 15 years really? This is insane.
crying little. <laughs> Ryan Little. <laughs> Yeah, mom. It's about to order me some Uber Eats because I am hungry. Well, they said I had a nice view. They didn't want. We had a swipe because the whole bunch of office buildings were like. I like still holding on because I fear heights. <laughs> so I'm like holding on to the ledge. Cause it's like, the last is so clear, it's ridiculous. I should probably turn up the brightness. Can you see me? Can you guys see me now? I will adjust the brightness in a second, but better for now. So. Um, obviously you can see I'm in the LaSalle. LaSalle? Yeah. So I'm in the hotel. Um, yeah. Chicago is gorgeous. It's so beautiful. Um, I'll have a sit down with you guys and tell you about the train ride. But smooth sailing. Everybody's extremely nice. Everybody's extremely helpful. And they upgraded my room. They upgraded my room. They upgraded my room. So I was supposed to have a um king like a superior king they gave me a deluxe they was like here's your bag miss wartson is this what you wanted i was like yeah can i have my check on um, my carry-on they was like yeah oh. but i was like yeah um can i have my carry-on and they was like here you go and by the way we upgraded your room to deluxe I have it a little bit more spacious for you and you get better views so I mean, it's not bad. Do you guys want to see the views? Are you interested or are you not interested? It's, it's right over there. Let me, let me show you real quick. Hold on. Okay. Taking you guys to... Now. Oh, that was way too bright. Hold on. Like that. I am definitely in a city. Skyscrapers. Skyscraper number one. Look how high up I am. It's insane. Okay. And then let's go to skyscraper number two. Do you see that baby back there? Sucker's gorgeous. These buildings are so freaking tall. And I'm on the 18th floor crazy right yeah this place is gorgeous <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to hold the elevator for you? <laughs> no, don't, don't rush, you're fine. Uh, which floor are you going on? One, okay, me too. No problem. Hotel room. Hotel room. I'm 
so much for the fact that I'm just waiting on my Disney Plus to be fixed. So hopefully they can help me with that. Yeah. But I don't think about me playing video games, so would y'all be interested in me playing Resident Evil, Spider-Man? Y'all let me know. We have played Resident Evil before, but we just didn't record it.
That's that bull crap. Sheesh. Wow. With extreme prejudice. Just terminate them. Yep, there it is. Mm, well, there you have it. So my TV just randomly came on and it says life's good. Oh, it's telling me it's time to wake up. Did I ask her to wake me up now? Let me go downstairs and pay for this room. Oh nice, they fixed my room. Guys, it says Jussie here. That is so nice. I still didn't ask y'all to wake me up though. Good morning, Jessie. Enjoy your day. Oh, that is so sweet. I still didn't ask y'all to wake me up though. Like, <laughs> it's so beautiful. The TV has an alarm clock, and then um, what do you call it? They're showing people all around the world waking up, like at different like locations. At each location is gorgeous. Hold on, let me show you, Mama. Imagine if I was sleeping though. I mean, they know that I was up because I called the front desk, but and that's so nice that they changed it. That makes my stay so much better because you know how much I hate when people call me Jessica. That's not my freaking name. But yeah, it is so beautiful. Enjoy your day. That is so sweet.